I'm Dragon, and today I will be creating a lizard based on what you're seeing right now. Here is the final result. This took three and a half hours to model. I was expecting longer. And with that, this is for 3D printing, so I will not be doing any fancy renders. I just did this one to show you the final result and to show you that mini animation at the beginning. With no further ado, let's jump into the time lapse of blender modeling and then 3D printing. So now the model is complete. So all I had left to do was put the model in Prusa Slicer and then 3D print it. So with this model, I ended up using supports and that is because this one wasn't exactly flat on the bottom and didn't really have a good area that I could use without supports. I'm not, this is like my second time really using supports. So it's so-so at the end. I don't know if this is how you would do it but i do know that it turned out pretty well as a 3d print so with that let's go to that
I hope you enjoyed seeing that time lapse of the blender modeling and the 3D printing. Unfortunately for the 3D printing part, the thing I was recording with ran out of memory, so it didn't finish, but I did get a half an hour out of the 40 something minutes that it took to 3D print. And as you can see in front of you, here are the models right on the printer. Still haven't taken the support material off, so let's do that right now. As you can see, this is actually taking a little bit longer than I expected. It didn't just come off, and it actually took around 8 to 9 minutes. I didn't use any tools, which now knowing that in advance, I am definitely going to use some tools to get this off because that was not the most fun thing. It kind of ruins your fingernails too. But I, with that, now let's go straight into what the model looks like without support material and as it's complete. So here is the lizard next to the support material, and ironically it turned out purple because I was using rainbow filament, so I guess I was making one of those purple lizards because there are purple lizards in the world. I thought that was pretty cool, but let's just go into showing you what the model looks like actually holding it and everything. So here we go, and there it is. I think it looked really cool and it turned out pretty good. I was pretty impressed because it's not very big and it has a lot of fine detail. I am really enjoying this Prusa Mini 3D printer. But anyway, thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and bye!